Hey, how's it going? Kendall here, and hope you're all having a really good day. And thank you for watching this video, and thank you for clicking it and taking time out to click it. Uh, this video is just kind of one of what will be many different vlogs in which I hope to be able to do like vlogs on like, you know, some behind the scenes things, things that I'm working on, whether it's my writing, cartooning, uh, sometimes it's just gonna be us talking. And I think we need that sometimes. And I think that it's a good time to do it. Um, you know, I'm about to be 40 years old in a few days. At the making of this video, the day is, I'm looking at my watch, uh, it is now, uh, uh, come on, what, what day is it? You know, it's so funny having a smart watch, but I don't feel, uh, anyway, I was about to make a joke about me and smart watches and smartphones and my smarts, but no, okay. So it's Tuesday, August 6th. So at the making of this video, August 12th is my birthday and I'm going to be 40 years old. And I've just been thinking about what 40 I thought 40 was gonna feel like and what 40 is. For me, 40 years old is not what I thought it would be. It just isn't, but I'm not complaining. I'm just saying that there's a lot of things that I've learned, there's a lot of things that I've experienced, there's a lot of growth that has come as a result of just the many years of, of being around people who were wiser than me, taking in information, reading, studying, um, you all, majority of you know on this on this channel of mine that I am a Christian. So the many years of studying the Bible, the many of years of trying to walk out this Christian faith, really trying to live for Jesus out here in these streets and really be consistent. I've been through so much and been through a lot, but I'll tell you what, I didn't know that 40 years old would be this. I had no idea. And I suppose that that would require a, a larger explanation to why I'm saying that. Um, some of that is because of career changes. Some of that is because of the fact that I'm married and, and I didn't know that I would have such a privilege to be married and married to somebody so amazing and so so sweet and so kind and so real and genuine. Um, and and Rachel is the best. She's awesome. One of the one of the best things that ever happened to me in my life. And so I'm grateful for that. Um, being somebody that's in ministry now and preaching and teaching and you know helping out with major institutions in the city of Dallas, you know college institutions, and reaching out trying to train young ministers, and then cartooning and and drawing and creating. And, and and really actually stepping out on faith and not allow myself to be um, anxious or fearful, so to speak. And so I'm, I've been reflecting a lot on what 40 is. Um, for a while, I was thinking to myself, oh my goodness, this is old, 40 is so old. And, and, and my wife is like, uh, no, no, it's not. And, and I'm inclined to agree with her. I, for me, I've been joking saying, hey, you know what? If I end up having a midlife crisis, my wife knows what to do. Let's go to GameStop. Let's, let's, go, to, let's go to Costco, wherever, and buy me a PS5. There we go. Boom. Just buy me a video game system. We're going to be good. But I also know that, you know, I'm, I'm also kind of kidding. Uh, the PS5 is going to probably be a while. That thing's expensive. But... I honestly have been thinking about what things I would like to get accomplished going into my 40s, doing more things in my life that's going to impact other people in such a way that's going to be even more positive and it's going to be more encouraging and that's going to actually help somebody else grow and grow up. And having the kind of fun that doesn't mean that I own a product, like a piece of technology, although I do enjoy technology that's not going away but actually having substantial fun that involves experience that it involves you know putting my feet on grass and actually <laughs> enjoying nature even though nature and i don't, don't nature and i and, and country and i don't necessarily get along but 
you know, but, but I mean, what I mean, what I mean by that is that like actual experience is going out and for some, for, I'm, I'm not sure yet entirely how I feel about 40. I'm, I'm processing it as, as I go. I'm excited about it. Actually, I'll tell you what, that's not true. I actually do know how I feel about 40. I actually feel very excited. I feel very curious about what's there to hold, but it's also making me evaluate some things in my life. Really, it is making me think about some things that um, that involve my career, that involve the future. You all, even today, as I'm recording this video, had a very interesting experience um, that happened today that taught me that being real and being honest and telling people the truth is the best policy and telling it like it is. Now, that doesn't mean I have to be a jerk about it. It doesn't mean I have to be mean about it, but it does mean I need to be firm about it. It does mean that I need to let people know that, no, this is not acceptable. You're telling me that something I'm doing is not acceptable. acceptable. No, this right here, <laughs> y'all got to cut this out <laughs> and, and letting people know that, that you know your worth. You're 40 years old. So many people don't know their worth. They don't know their value. They don't know what they bring to the table, whether it's on the job or in ministry or in family or things like that. And and I'm getting to a place now, finally, where I understand that you want to know something? People don't have to walk over me and I don't have to take it either. And I can still be humble and, and, and still treat people well without being a doormat. And, and things like that, like, like actual substantive things. Uh, I'm so grateful and thankful to God that now I'm, I'm in that place, but there's still so much more growth. And I can't wait to, 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 to continue to further get into a place, which now I'm, I'm, I'm getting there now with some opportunities that have come up recently in my life. I'm getting into a place now to where I'm able to help other young men and other young people and just people period around me, encouraging them to press forward. Now, it doesn't mean that that I know everything at all. It just means that I get a chance to be a part of the solutions rather than having anything to do with being a part of the problem. And for me, that's, that's, that's being 40 uh, or at least getting to being 40. Um, I get to grow older and, um, by the grace of God, I see August 12th, Monday of 2024, as I'm doing this video, I'm hoping to make even more. I'm hoping to put even more videos out there as I just share and talk with you all. Uh, I want to do more drawing, of course, and more creating, of course. And I'm going to continue to do that and uh, do my best to bring it and make it interesting. And uh, whether you're watching me intently or whether you're watching, listening to it in the background, um, I would appreciate if you just like and subscribe, continue to follow these videos. And uh, I think we'll have a good time as we do that. And um, I'm hoping uh, that over time, you know, my art and the craft and the way that I do these things um, grow and get better and better and better. Um, so I want to I want to gracefully age and I want my work to do the same. <laughs> so with that, you take care. Have a good one. We'll catch you on the next vlog. See you all.